Hello everyone. How are you today? So, what has it been like a month? Two months? Do you want to know my struggle? I feel like I'm lopsided. My struggle, which most of you already know, is my hair. Okay, I, I regret cutting it off. I told you that already. Now I don't have, I don't know what else to do with it. So we just have those braids, which I don't like. Um. Well, first of all, how y'all doing? How y'all been? I just come in complaining. Are you okay? Like, get yourself together. No one wants to hear about your complaints. But anyway, back to complaining. This does not work. It's trash. Like, when I first got this, I exchanged it like four times because I thought it was jacked up. I wasn't able to hear through the um, headphone. It was only one time I was able to hear myself talking as I'm talking through this. I thought it was connecting when I was using it on my phone. I think it did for a minute and then it stopped. Now I won't connect to my computer. I won't connect to my phone anymore. It's just it's just so annoying. And that's the microphone I want to use to, you know, kind of whisper and talk low and all that. But I can't. And then if I try to use this, then, then it's going to block out my, a lot of my chewing. So I'm just irritated. It's just been annoying. And I just haven't prioritized making this because I can't use the microphone I want to use. Anyway, so do you like my cup? I think it's Amazon stuff. Well, I got this from, where do you think I got it from? How much do you think I paid? Well, I thought that cast oil was working for my bags. It's just not. If I get to get these bags taken away, I don't even matter my my laugh lines but my bags oh my gosh they say castle will work it's only been a week or two but i want it gone gone now <sighs> when i have my background the same color as my face i feel like a new woman i'm gonna have to start um i wish i could stick my head in a tanning booth and just get these taken care of <laughs> But that wouldn't even work though, right? Because don't they make you put eye covers on to go in there? So that's a no-go. And anyway, I don't do chemical stuff anyway. So I'm trying to stay away from the chemical stuff. But I want these bags gone. I can't wait until my hair grow back, or at least long enough for me to do about. I'm so annoyed. So in here is bone broth. Have you ever had bone broth? No, 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 no. Not the kind from the store in the box. I'm talking about making your own bone broth from beef bones. No? You should try it. This is the real collagen, not the collagen you buy from the store with the little powder mix. This is where collagen comes from. And I'm drinking it because it's good for your gut. And it says it'll help your nails and your hair grow. Y'all know my nails been tripping lately. I need them back to normal. And I need my hair to come back. So I've been drinking this like crazy. Ooh, I didn't mean to shake the table. Um, what was I saying? Oh. I'm on day 66 of 75 hard. Oh my gosh, I will be done with this one next Thursday. That's my last day next Thursday. And I cannot wait. Why am I holding that like this? I cannot wait to be done with this. Not even so I can eat so much. It's because, okay, I've maintained at 158. If I wouldn't have been on this, I would have been at least 180 by now with lifting weights and stuff. But I am so slim. I'm losing parts I don't want to be losing. Nobody got no boogie. It feel like it. But, um, yeah, I'm just over it. I'm tired of um, working out two times a day. Like, it's not that I can't do it. It's just that it doesn't work with what I'm trying to do with my body. You know what I'm saying? So I'm getting slimmer when I'm already slim. And I don't want to be a, be slim. You know what I'm saying? So, but next week, I'll be done with this. 
No, I won't be eating Thanksgiving dinner because I'll still be on this. Yes, I planned it wrong. Whatever. My honey will be done Monday, though. So that's good. Um, what else? It's been so long. I should have so much to talk about. Oh, dang, what else? Oh, okay. Have you ever thought about, like, reinventing yourself? I know people probably think, oh, you're too old to do that. No, you're never too old. As long as you're alive, you do whatever the heck you want to do. Let me know down below if you ever thought about reinventing yourself. So I've always wanted to be like this classy, feminine, super feminine woman, right? But I feel like I'm so tomboy. Like, I don't want to be that anymore. I want to be super classy and super um, girly and feminine and stuff. I don't know why. I've always just wanted to be like this. I think what did tear me from being like that is because I have big feet, right? So I wear size 12. I used to wear size 11, then I had D, and now it's 12. So it's always been hard to find shoes in my size, cute shoes. Or they'll be like long and like a little heel like this big. <laughs> but now, the shoes are big enough for me to fit. So, but I don't know now because now I want to do the whole shoes for your natural shape type thing the natural shape of your foot because y'all do know uh, my nose feel like it's all the run. i don't got no tissue hope it's not running down my face <laughs> sorry see that's not lady like that's not feminine like get yourself together like when i first started you know it's kind of cute a lot of the time wear a little makeup i don't want to wear a lot of makeup just a little bit i'm gonna cover this up throw on some lip gloss and eye um mascara you know that to be straight but my hair has been holding me back a lot in my life. And I don't understand because my hair used to be nice. Like, it used to be so nice. I don't understand why can't it just stay the same. But anyway, so y'all do know that the shoes that we wear are not the natural shape of our foot or the way it's supposed to be. It may be the shape of your foot now because it's been formed into the way the shoes look. But... Like, if you look at your footprint when you were a baby, your toes were this wide and your little heel was tiny. So, the toes were wider at the top than it was at the bottom. But now, it, like, forms in the shape of the shoe. It's not supposed to be like that. So, I've really been looking into, like, um, um, they're called barefoot shoes. Or it'll be, like, square toe shoes or bare, you know, natural shape of, sh um, feet shoes, something like that to where the toe box, which is what the part of the toe of the shoe is called, it'll be more to fit your feet so that they can kind of like spread out, not be on top of each other. So like corns and bunions and your feet curving and your bones sticking out on the side, that's not normal. Back pain, uh, knee pain, feet pain, foot pain, that stuff is not normal. And it all starts with your feet and your shoes. So I'm thinking about going you know, to like some flat um, square toe box shoes. I really want these gorilla shoes where the toe is kind of separate. Each toe is separated. Y'all probably seen them before. But I really want to do that, but I don't know. But how can I be cute and classy with that kind of stuff? Like, that's like comfortable stuff. But then it's like the older you get, the more you want to be comfortable and the more you want your feet to be okay. Like, heels, heels are not natural. You definitely gonna have foot and back pain with heels. But you'll be cute though. I'll be cute. I don't know. I'm gonna figure it out. So I'm so mad at this mic. I remember it working at one point in time. I'm sure some old videos has this mic working. And then I tried to start on my MacBook. It wouldn't even start up. Like it went to update and it just got stuck. <laughs> so I hope this sound is okay. I don't know. Well, I'm just gonna go. I just wanted to come in and say hey. I'll be back. Hopefully. <laughs> Remember to smile because you're beautiful and love yourself. Because if you don't love yourself, why would anyone else? Until next time. Bye.